Uh, all right, this is uh, me again, guys. Um, Jerome Verhoeven. Just going to show you the DHU as well as the app for the firmware update feature on the uh, DryMax XL and DryLink app. So I had another video showing you how to get to this feature. Um, we'll go ahead and select this dehumidifier. We'll go to more information. Once that loads. So there we are. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and go to edit details. Um, show advanced options. All right, so we will start out with the UI update. Uh, you know, just to kind of show you what we are at right now. If we go into the diagnostic screen, all right, we'll see 3.8, which is what is in the app. 3.4 on the power board. So we're going to go ahead and update these guys. We can exit this. Uh, doesn't really matter too much which one you update first or second. We will start out with the uh, UI board. I'm going to set my phone down. Um, we'll retry this guy. So the first time it had some trouble getting the board into um, the update mode, and you can see now it is uh, sending the firmware over to it. It'll indicate, uh, you know, 3%, 4%. If you can see it incrementing slowly on my screen here, um, the board is getting uh, updated down there. It's about a two minute process, uh, at least on my phone. There can be some variability from handset to handset. So um, I'm going to pause the video and start after the. Uh, firmware update sequence is almost complete. All right, you can see here my phone is at 95. I don't know if you can get a good view of that on the camera or not. Uh, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. The display board on your firmware now has the latest update. So you kind of saw it restart there. As you can see, we should be keeping all of our hours and everything the same on here. But if we go into diagnostic mode now, and check this firmware version. We are at the latest and greatest, 0 0.3.10. Um, and from now on, uh, with this rev and above, whenever we're updating the firmware uh, on the UI board, we'll actually pop a message up there saying we are updating firmware, um, you know, just so it's a little more intuitive.